Decography skills with creativity. Please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel and click the bell to be notified when we post new videos. Yeah, good morning guys. Welcome back to the Cool Gravity Design Training. I believe we're doing great today. Uh, right now I want to show you how you can get a 3D with the logo. How you can get it done on your Android smartphone in less than 10 minutes. I believe majority of us are having issue on how we can run or transform our logo into 3D format using our Android smartphone. I came this morning with amazing steps on how you can solve all this. In this tutorial, there's so much to learn. I'm going to list them one by one. The first thing I'm going to teach you how to, you can make create a business logo. Second thing, I'm going to teach you how you can choose a color preference, even if you have no idea. The third thing, I'm going to teach you how you can manage your way with alignment. And I'm going to teach you how you can present this particular mock design on the mockup, not ordinary mockup, 3D within mockup. Then at the end of the day, you are going to learn how to retain your color because 3D wooden makeup will transform your color to another texture color. I'm going to teach you how you can retain your original primary color. Without wasting much of our time, let's get started. The first thing to do, I'm going to the shape here. After selecting the shape, choose this. Then you click OK. You can increase the size a little bit. Have the position and cropping like this. Position it around here. Then you are going to centralize it. Heading back to your gallery. Where you have this particular uh, uh, picture. I download this on a preferred pick. Then I am going to position it as perfect. As perfect as this. Then position it to the center. Make sure you arrange it very well. Then the next thing to do. You are heading back to your gallery. When you get there. Then you are going to crop and arrange this. You position it perfectly around this particular area so you can make sure that uh, you blend and uh, you cheat this particular shape by making sure that everything work along with the way you actually want it so when you are able to do that the next thing to do change the color to black then upon that send it to the back then you have this amazing result when you have this we are going to change the color to this we change the color to something like blue which has a touch of that in the cap. Then the next thing we are going to do, we can try a little bit to stretch. Yeah, we can stretch by locking this, locking this, then we can stretch this down a little bit. After stretching, the next thing to do is to put this one in. Then we have our amazing result, just as perfect as this. After that has been done, then the next thing to do, we are going to cut out some parts here go into your mask this will give an avenue to learn little thing about the mask then after that we are going to position this around there just to cut the extra shape that is located around the image to have a clean work don't cut the yarns then you enable for you to be able to see cutting the outer part not the inner part because the inner part we want to use to cover this mess so after that has been done, then the next thing we can do is to shift in this a little bit. Just shift it in a little bit. Okay, perfect. Then after that, we have this particular position. We we'll position this around there. Okay. We we'll have this position around there. Okay, perfect. Then these, we have this around here, where we are going to readjust, okay. We have this. Perfect. Now we can click OK and rest assured that everything is actually cool. Then the next thing we are going to do, I am going to merge everything together, not to take much of our time. After merging together, I'm going to reduce the size a little bit, just as perfect as this. Click on your relative position to position to the center. Heading back to the text area where we will have the brand name, the business name, which is uh, Kenny's. So we have Kenny's. Okay. 
Kenny's perfect I'm going to use a very bold font called Lixpatan Lixpatan bold so I'm going to use that to be the heading so position that one here is cool and amazing so position that around there perfect don't forget to use your aligned I, I mean relative position as the color be changed change the color to background color of the image then you're heading back to your gala to your text area where you have the underwear which is what the uh, or the brand name is all about then you use a font called a beautiful font we have a beautiful font here beautiful people fonts you position that around here make sure you change the color to something of this uh, bikini so i want to use the color picker to pick that so that it won't be that was done at the at the screen but you pick very well like professional don't pick anyhow otherwise you end up picking the fake color for decision that at the middle of this but very close and not too uh, spacious you can use your movement button arrow to adjust and arrange after that position these at the center as well then what you are going to do next you are going to boot this to be able to be obvious as well perfect now move it down a little bit with your movement arrow after that has been done i'm having an issue with it because i want it to be clearly written so i will give it a little space in between the alphabet after that has been done i want to cheat this particular arrangement by allowing each of the text and each of the alphabet to, uh, to show and display independently after that has been done i will make sure that i lock the tray so that my hands will not be touching it i will head in directly back to my gallery i mean to the text area where i'm going to put in all my text we are we are or let's say we deal on this will could be cool we deal on so we have this uh we deal on what that's what will be the next action so we have underwear we deal on underwear underwears so we have these we have underwears we have nightwears okay perfect then we have laundry wears then we have swim swim suit so let's say we have swim suit then uh, we have what we still have a uh, sheep wears we have sheep sorry we have sheep wears okay then uh, the sheep wears is for male and female we have sheep wells for for male so we cannot have for female males so let's say females and kids and kills okay perfect so now that we have that the next thing we're going to do is to go to the font we want to use a font called multi-zera so we use the font called multi-zera board so which we are going to reduce the size just as perfect as this reduce the size well so you increase so after reducing the size we position it here go to alignment and you align to the center so i want it to be reduced and uh, perfect than this so i'm going to position it here so let there be space in between the uh, uh, the right up so a little bit so after that i'm going to use my relative position to position it to the center so we have this at the end of the day right so the next thing i'm going to do is to got uh, i'm shifting it up a little bit so we have this so the next thing i'm going to do uh, right now is to copy so i'm copying and i have in my own phone number so where we have plus two three four seven oh three four six six zero seven eight one okay so now the next thing to do we are going to increase the size a little bit so have it position around here first so the next thing we are still going to do is to have uh, the 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 uh we have kenny's at kenny's underscore that is an instagram underscore underwear 
and the wheels okay perfect so that will be positioned around here so now we can head him back to our gallery where we are going to bring all the social media and i call which we are going to use so taking for instance we are going to use this okay perfect position this around here so we can shift this to come down a bit where we have our social media and icon here so we're heading back to our gallery where we're going to bring the second one and that will be going to be positioned around here so perfect so after position the two we're going to lock the icon for us to be able to move in so everything is plumb exactly the way we want it okay perfect then we can position this here after that has been done we go into the transparent icon and we are going to save okay sorry so we export our image as what as ultra and as png so now we save our work we are heading back to where we are heading back to our browser this is our browser so get into the browser let me reload it that's the www.photopea.com click on open from computer and click on file now locate where you have your mock-up this is my own markup with markup then you load you you have to wait you wait for it even whether you are using 100 gig ram phone or you are using 200 or 1 million storage is one terabyte you need to follow process before you can get things done chapter is a that you'll be looking at the screen of your phone in no time you see the result when you see the result you can proceed there's what we call it buffer buffer hold an information online before it becomes processed any website does that no website transform or change or loading any information quickly like magic there's nothing of such it just depends on the website anyway how fast it will be but not like you post something and immediately within seconds everything will start started changing you know you need to follow process and remember you are running a psd file each psd file work along with the way of the configure it so you need to wait a little bit when it comes to within makeup the mock-up i used before this one was so fast under one minute i'm done with everything now you see this is already loaded so everything stated you are going to learn it you go down not in display what can we do tap on this normal change it then you see your result with display after you are after you are ready there are two ways you can change it immediately you might not change it immediately i are going to change it back then it won't disappear again double tap then you hide this might pop up just close the window here very simple then you might not see what you are doing again still repeat the same process now hide when you hide it go back to the file open and place go to the file locate where you have the design we just make with our pixella then the next thing you are going to do when you see such is to tap so tap on the design for you to have it overlay after that just tap on the what tap on open save with smart object after you tap that be looking at the screen of your phone if you are in haste just drop your phone be looking at it immediately you see smart object updated you are going to tap on the uh, file name of this psd file for it to transform and show you immediately it's done you see smart object updated tap on this 3d wall you can just tap once i'm only tapping for you to be able to see what i'm typing you see where my cursor is blinking you have to type this once when you tap it just fold your hands and be looking at the screen of your phone in no time you see your logo will transform immediately transform you can proceed by what proceed with the other editing because immediately transform it will transform everything to wooden wooden color when you see that then how can you retain your color is what i'm going to show you i'm going to teach you that here as i said and if you want to further knowing more about the editing here and all that stuff how you can modify your psd file you can edit how you can retain some color how you can change the font and other please you stay tuned on this uh, channel click the bell icon so that you can be notified whenever i update my channel with amazing video and don't forget to subscribe if you are new here don't forget to share like and comment because that one will keep me going and if you want to know more expand your knowledge design like a pro you can join my ongoing training it's still available
a cheaper price you are going to learn how to be independent we empower you to join our community and to deal with the live big project using your smartphone the more you see the more you look the more you see the less you see that is what i can say about the smartphone amazing tips what your smartphone can do is depend on your creativity so while we're waiting you can tap here again and be looking at the screen in no time we see the result here then you can proceed then you can see what i'm seeing when it transforms, you can see everything transform to wood how can we deal with this and we need it because this is useless right after wasting my time this is not what i'm expecting yes this is not what i'm expecting what can i do go in there change this for you to be able to see everything okay change it after you see everything the next thing you are going to do tap on instruction extrusion when you tap on that the next thing you are going to do is to you see we have the first one after you tap the drop you, you tap on the instruction we have logo first logo second you see in front of that logo we have e double f e double f there is a downward arrow there is downward arrow there's an arrow fixing the right click on it to fix down this is what i'm seeing when you click there is an arrow fixing down i tap on it then i have this this is an arrow facing down tap on the gradient overlay when you tap on gradient overlay you can see it will bring back your color when you tap on it you need to wait you can see the result just tap on that just one click you can see very good then you are going to move down gently go back to the file we are done with everything go back to a spot and click on png we are tapping then be looking at the screen for another window to pop up where you have your save then you see downloading immediately your work is downloading then you view it then you can see your work are we this not amazing under 10 minutes we are done with everything time for watching i believe we all learn something from here don't forget to comment like share and don't forget to subscribe hit the bell icon so that you can still update with my channel update like this time for watching once again god bless